and welcome back to Red Gaming Tech. Today is the 12th of October. My name is Amata and this time I'm bringing you something a little bit different. As Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag director, who goes by the name of Ashraf Ismail, has expressed a desire to take the series to ancient Egypt. Now, he did discuss this particular topic in an interview with the Examiner. And he said, quote, I'm not saying we are going to go there, but one day I would love to explore Egypt as a setting for this game. Ancient Egypt could be a really cool place. We have a really cool explanation for how we can do this. And it is with this Animus device that allows us to go to any time in history. But he did note that it's taken two and a half years to make Assassin's Creed 4. And the series, of course, is an annual release. So even if his higher-ups were to grant Ismail his wish, it wouldn't actually come out until three more games down the line in 2016. So it'd be quite a ways off even if it were to happen. And he also noted that he was rather surprised by the resistance that to the fact that Assassin's Creed 4 is based in an era prior to Assassin's Creed 3's Civil War setting. But he said that being able to skip around in time is one of the series' of best assets. And he said, quote, I'll say one of the best things we have going for us is how we can play with history. It was never a set rule that we can always get closer to the present day. We're a bit surprised by people who saying, how do you go back in time? How's that possible? It's that animus device we have. But then again, I'm not saying age Egypt is where the next one is going. It's just where I would like it to go. So I to be honest, I'm not overly surprised myself that there's still some resistance to Black Flag setting because up until this point we have been going fairly steadily forward in time. Now that does not necessarily to say that we can't have someone who has an ancestor further back. Of course it's not actually time travel that's happening so it's more than possible that we could even go way way back or skip forward and then go back again and that sort of thing. We have many many years to play with many many ancestors and possibilities to play with and of course many many locations that could be played with so i was a little bit surprised myself when they announced the setting of assassin's creed 4 as being a little bit back in time from assassin's creed 3 civil war setting but it wasn't because i thought how can you go back in time because well that's not really what's happening it was just a bit of a surprise for it to break the formula of always going forward now personally i think an agent egypt and assassin's creed would be so 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 cool i would love that to bits and of course a feudal japan one would probably be one of my personal favorite picks but back in november 2011 ubisoft did actually issue a survey which asked the public where they'd like the next game in the series to go and the options were the violent conflicts of the imperial dynasties in medieval China, the advent of the mighty British Empire during Victorian England, the culmination of the pharaoh reign in ancient Egypt, the invasion of the Americas by the Spanish conquistadors, the confrontation between British colonists and Native Americans during the American Revolution, of course we've had that already, the overthrow of the Tsar Empire by the communists during the Russian Revolution, the warlord battles in feudal Japan, the rise of Caesar's empire in ancient Rome. So, out from that particular list, ancient Egypt, massive yes, British Empire in Victorian England, yes, 100%, thousand times, million yes, warlord battles in feudal Japan, yes, Caesar's Empire, Ancient Rome, so much yes. So which ones out of that one, would, out of that particular list, excuse me, would you actually pick? Which would be your top pick? My top pick would probably be Feudal Japan and then Ancient Egypt and maybe Rome. Um, actually, no, no, no. British Empire would be above Rome, but still. You get the idea. Which ones would you pick? What would be your top pick? And what would you think of an Assassin's Creed game set in Egypt? I personally would love the hell out of it. And I think that it'd be interesting to deal with a very different culture to what we've seen. Of course, it would be kind of more in line with the culture that we saw back in Assassin's Creed, the original. But still, it'd be very different to the kind of culture and experience that we've had in the last few games. Of course, Assassin's Creed 2. Brotherhood and Revelations being primarily set in Italy and that sort of thing. And then of course Assassin's Creed 3 set in Civil War America. So I think it would be a very interesting setting indeed. And I do agree with what he's saying. The strength of this series is to be able to go to any point in time. And I don't think they should be limited to go only going forward. If they feel that going back to ancient Egypt is a good direction for the series. And then they have my full support anyway that is me done for this video i hope you've enjoyed it thank you very much for watching and i'll see you next time